working um, within the limestone are um, calcite deposits, and those are actually called slime. Um, so we do monitor the spot line to see if it has moved or anything like that. And since we've been monitoring it, um, it has not moved or shifted at all. Um, and even when we did have that earthquake a few years ago in Magna, we were very curious to see just, you know, if it would affect the cave at all. And in here, it was like nothing had ever happened. Um, the fault line was completely um, in the same place. You know, none of the formations or anything like that were disturbed at all. Uh, so they always say that when there is an earthquake, it is much safer to be inside of a cave than outside of a cave. Um, so everything inside of a cave is very stable and very unlikely to move or anything like that. Has it Okay, so in this next area, we do have an area that gets pretty low. Um, there is a railing on the right side, so as long as you have that railing there, just make sure to keep your head low throughout that whole area. So you see the fault line right there. Amazing. This is like walk like a duck. Where's the entrance? Uh, right at the end, right here. Okay, very cool. All right, we made it. We made it through the cave system. So thank you guys so much for coming with thank me throughout you. the cave. Um, so right now, I'm just going to stick around for a couple of extra minutes if you do have any questions or anything. We do have a guest book if you guys want to sign that. Um, if you guys are coming. Yeah, I'm like,